Oh, I think it's fantastic that Santa Anita is having it here again this year. I mean, the weather should be beautiful, and uh, we're going to get people from all over the country coming. And uh, you can't ask for a better venue. And the mountains in the background, the scenery, and we're going to have fantastic racing. Pull in for Joe. I okay. hope Joe wins a couple of races. <laughs> yeah, um, I, as long as we all have safe, the races are safe. And, and uh, Mr. Talamo, little Joe Talamo can win a couple of races. It'll, it'll, it'll be great. The whole whole of racing will be great. But Santa Anita's, how can you beat it? Yeah. How can you beat it? And in the classic, the post position's good. It's a tall order, a really tough race. And uh, just hoping we run our, our, the best race of our life, really, and hopefully we can get a piece of it. Now, do you like shipping in this post yeah. race? Do you like them getting their last work over their home track and all that? Uh, I like training at my home track and just shipping in the week of the race. Anytime we ship long distances is typically how we do it. And how are you liking Breeders' Cup being at Santa Anita and obviously going to be here next year as well? Do you like the fact that it's West Coast weather or is that harder for you since you are shipping in? You know, I'm based in New York, so uh, the long ship, um, you know, it's not always ideal. However, we've won two Breeders' Cup races when it has been here, held here at Santa Anita, so I can't argue too much with the venue. The weather's always good and we've had success here, so you know, I'm okay with it. Antonia, uh, when exactly did she ship in? She shipped in on the 22nd out of Baltimore, and she shipped in nicely. Seems like she didn't mind the ship at all, cleaned up her grain, and uh, since she's been on the track, she's been doing very well. She worked this morning, right? Yeah, she worked this morning. We went a half. Out five eights. The uh, clocker got her in 46 and three. I got the, the the gallop out in 58 and three. So that went really nice. She seemed like she did it very comfortably. The next couple of days, you said tomorrow she'll walk and then uh, go out to the track and maybe jog. Just yeah, she fit. she'll walk tomorrow and then the first day back she'll just jog a mile and uh, probably gallop the next two days. After that, we'll see the the few days before the Breeders' Cup. We'll work out a plan for. Her. How different is the weather right now as it is compared to Woodbine? Well, I mean, it's it's cool. It's a lot warmer here than it is there. Um, you know, so she's, I was, you know, worried to see how she would, you know, acclimate to the warmer climate, but she seems like she's doing just fine. 